Hey, Indianola First, wanted to give you a quick update about all that's happening at the church here as we move into fall, as people get back to school and back to work, and as we kind of move beyond, I, I pray moving beyond this pandemic thing. Um, anyway, I uh, wanted you to know that we are, we've been open since June. Things have been going really well. A lot of you know, have been here. Uh, it's really about 50% are attending here physically, 50% online. And, and we appreciate all of you that have been so committed to watching every week online. And especially that your giving has been wonderful as well. And we appreciate that. But uh, we are looking forward to that day. We can all be together again physically. I wanted you to know, this is really a safe place to come and be. We have done everything we can according to CD guide, CDC guidelines. And um, there, you know, we got the hand sanitizers, we got social distancing, we got all these things in place. And if you wanna come and you really wanna be social distanced, uh, you can do that and be very safe, I believe, in this place. Um, also, wanted to just uh, let you know that kids ministry is one of those areas that we've been missing so much. And we're starting to back up this Sunday with our takeoff preschool and our kids blast meeting. We won't be ready to start nursery quite yet, but uh, that's coming very, very soon. And uh, Amelia's, Pastor Amelia is gonna be putting out a video real soon about that, about all the details and how that's gonna work with the kids ministry. So be watching for that as well. Um, the Bistro is opening up uh, slowly. It's already open, but uh, we're gonna be adding things to the menu, back to the menu, I guess, and, and getting that rolling. And, and just all the ministries of the church are just kind of gradually coming back as, as people feel safe and everybody's learned how to do things the right way in order to keep uh, germs to themselves and, and, and everything. Uh, we, uh, one, you know, we've been busy during this time. We've had a lot of things going on. Just wanna update you on a couple of them. Uh, the Heal House, we've teamed up with an organization called The Heal House, which is really a, a, an organization that, that helps create emergency housing within uh, counties. And we haven't had good emergency housing in Warren County uh, that I can ever really remember since being here. But we now have uh, Heal House. They took over the Old Woods Motel, which is wonderful. And we sponsored a room there. It's the Blessed and Highly Favored Room. And uh, that's gonna be uh, revealed uh, we, we, we've used our own church money and, and outfitted the room with, with everything you would expect to find in a hotel room um, for, for this emergency housing. But anyway, that's gonna be an open house on August 30th from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. And then also I wanted to let you know that we have teamed up with Free Clinics of Iowa uh, and we have started construction on building a free medical clinic right within this church. It's gonna have its own entrance. Uh, it's gonna be a separate area that you won't be able to get into from the church. You have to go around and go in from the outside. But it's a wonderful ministry that's, that's just kind of happened. And there's been so many hands uh, that have gotten involved in, in construction and gotten involved in, in cleanup and all the things that we're doing to make that happen. They're just taking some square footage and we're gonna build it for them and make it nice. So, so excited about that and how that's gonna outreach to our community. I wanted to uh, just again thank you for your support of the church during this time, but I, I, I just wanna say, man, we're coming back, and we're coming back stronger than ever. So excited to see you, so excited to have everybody together again. Uh, we'll talk to you soon, God bless.